Hi, and welcome to the explanation of the problem Archipelago uh, for the program contest Bergenhofen Schwitzwerden. So the synopsis of the problem is that you're working for a company that is trying to make a network between a group of islands that are located somewhere out in the ocean. And the challenge of it all is the fact that they can build a ton of ferries, but they can also only build one airport to actually arrive at the destination where all the uh, islands are and they're trying to decide which islands are most useful for placing this single airport and the way they've decided it is by saying that the island an island that is re can reach as many islands as possible by ferry hopping uh, will be the most suitable candidates so in this sample uh, example here we have four islands and uh, denoted by n and a distance that the ferries can travel without refueling uh, equals e equaling three and so we have the four, four islands here, one, two, three, and four, denoted by their x and y coordinates. And if we visualize this, we can see it will look something like this. And we can actually uh, make a ferry uh, trip between the first and the third island. So they are the most useful islands to building an airport because they, are, they can reach the most amount of islands. So how can we actually figure it out which islands there are when there are a ton of islands instead? Well, we can use the union find structure, structure that uh, will help us uh, be able to connect a ton of islands that are, are reachable by ferry. So if we want to union find, we need uh, a list that has uh, every single island starting off as their index uh, uh, that are the islands. And then we want two methods. We want to use a find method that allows us to uh, look up what the root of an island is. So what kind of component is it part of? And then we also want to use a union uh, method that allows us to uh, set one of the islands to be a part of a group that represents the, the other island as well. So this is how we can connect two islands together to show that they are part of the same network. But how do you find these edges that we want to, uh, that allows us to connect the different islands? We can do this when we do the input. So we know we're gonna check through uh, uh, and islands and read them in and we can just read in the input as X and Y for every single island and then we can compare them through to um, all the previous islands we have found uh, by reading through the input and then checking if the Euclidean distance uh, I'm just going to write right to Euclid here uh, of X and Y to this uh, previous x and previous y is less than or equal to the distance we have been given in the input. And if this is the case, then we end up just union, uh, unioning these two islands. Uh, uh, yeah. So this is how we uh, can find all the edges between the islands. And when we have done this, then we can just uh, put all of these groups into dictionaries where the key will be the root that is in our union find, where, which is the uh, island that all of the other islands that are same, the same uh, network have been connected to, and its value will be all of the islands that is a part of its network. Uh, and then we can just uh, print out this sorted dictionary uh, on uh, the maximum amount of values. Pretty much. And then we will have solved the task. Thank you.